The city of San Diego is looking into boosting social equity and eliminating disparities. Right now, city officials are working to create a budget for the next fiscal year. CBS 8's Regina Yorita takes us to a neighborhood that is looking to get the attention of city leaders. Barrio Logan families who have lived here for years tell me improvements need to be made for all sorts of issues. The city has shifted its focus onto a neighborhood south of Interstate 8. While families are appreciative of that, they want to see those promises turn into action. There's now a new approach in deciding the city's $2 billion budget for the 2024 fiscal year. Departments are under more scrutiny for every decision that could significantly favor some neighborhoods or demographics more than others. According to the city, each department head has been assigned an equity-centered coach. All employees have been given equity training and the city's budgeting software has been upgraded to evaluate decisions based on equity. The new approach is to make leaders more aware of the sharp disparities. It also focuses on communities like Barrio Logan that have long suffered with underfunding. Yeah, I think the mayor should put more boots on the ground and come out here and show his face. Um, we have a lot of big projects going on that I know they want to do for uh, low income housing and stuff that I've been seeing. Um, but there's other stuff that we need as well. Recent city reports show that northern communities generally have larger libraries and more parks. This evening, I talked to families who have lived in Barrio Logan and have noticed the lack of working streetlights, sidewalks, and other key pieces of infrastructure. We do need more streetlights. Um, it does get pretty dark. Um, at night um, and also a, like stop signs. I think um, the um, Chicano Park, the playground and the public bathrooms there. I know just recently they changed the parking here. So they made more space for like people to park here, but mainly just the parking the park area. They also tell me issues surrounding homelessness and the need for health care in the area that should be top priorities for leaders. More like public clinics and stuff like that. Um, uh, we're blessed that we have insurance through our uh, employer, but not a lot of people do. City officials say a new budgeting software is a key step because it allows departments to see where disparities exist. The city council has a deadline of June 12 to finalize the budget for fiscal year 2024, which will begin July 1st. Regina Yurita, CBS 8.